Hey guys, let's see how to fix the Dell Latitude 7490 not turning on. As you can see, I have just a black screen and I can check some things here, right? The first one is just remove the power cable from here and try to turn on the computer. So you do this by flashing uh, the power from the computer, draining the power from the computer. Just click and hold the button here for 30 seconds. So I'm just pressing here and holding for 30 seconds. You see here that I have some light on the keyboard and also here the logo on the screen, right? If you don't have any light here or any logo on the screen, perhaps you don't have the battery good enough, right? Then you need to try something else. Right now I'm just holding it, waiting for Windows to boot up. And this drains uh, the power from the motherboard and boot up the computer as you can see here, it's working right now, right? Then if that doesn't work for you, let me just try something else. I'm going to shut it down and then I can try something else, okay? So remember that you need power to power on your computer. Sometimes the battery is not working at all. So you need to check here the cable and make sure that you have power enough uh, coming to your laptop. Just make sure that you have the cable connected to a good power outlet. And also you can test here if you have something like a multimeter. I have here, see, a multimeter, right? Multimeter. And then you just put it here and you can reach this pin inside with the probe and the external side here as well, right? So I'm going to insert here the probe and try to reach as best as I can the pin inside. I need to touch the pin, okay? And then here in the outside, you just touch the this part here, okay? Sometimes it's a little hard because you need to make sure that it's reaching the pin inside here. And then the outside. And also remember to put it here on the scale of the continuous voltage, right? Let me just try again. Sorry guys, but sometimes it's just a little bit hard to do it. You see here, now I got it, 19.3 volts, right? So it's basically here, it's working, I have power. The power supply is 19 volts, continuous, right? So it's working fine. Then I put it here and try to boot up again. And now I can see that's going to work because I have power, right? If I press here again, you see that I have lights on the keyboard and the computer is going to turn on, right? If it's not your case, you need to do something else that's check the battery. Unfortunately, there is no other way than open the computer and try to check if the battery is good and the battery is working, right? So let me just shut it down here one more time. There we go. You see that you don't have any other interface and any other things here to try other than the button, the power button, okay? And the battery, the, uh, the power supply, sorry, that you can connect here. Other than that, you need to open your computer. So basically you need to come here and use some tools to open it up. So just grab a Phillips screwdriver, you know, you remo remove all the screws. There we go. Just remove the cover and here you can see the battery, right? So you can just use this one here to pull out and remove from the battery. Let me just approach here so you see better. There we go. This one here, you can just pull it out like this. So you remove the battery, right, from the motherboard. Then you just wait for one to two minutes and you can put it back, right? And see if it works again. Other thing that you can do here is also remove the battery from here. You can just pull this out. So it's connected here, the battery. Also wait for some time and put it back. Okay, so super simple. Then you put everything back into place. Just put this back here, easier that way. Put back into place. Close it again and turn it on one more time. Okay, so basically that's the idea.
There we go. After this, you can just turn your computer back on. One more time, press here. Now I see that I have some lights here on the keyboard. So it's basically working. Okay. And I just need to wait for the computer to boot up. See the, the, the logo here on the screen. After I remove the battery and put it back, usually it takes a longer time to see the logo here, but it's going to work, all right? I'll just press one more time here, just to make sure that I'm turning it on. There we go, the laptop is coming back, right? So it's basically working. There's also a light here that you can't see sometimes. This LED light here flashing, right? So just make sure to check to check all of this and you're good to go. You can have your computer back on. So basically that's the way you can solve the problem with the Dell Latitude 7490 not turning on. You see here, for example, now that I have this information about the need to run the setup program because I just removed and put the battery back and it's going to work, okay? So from here, I can just press F1 to set it up uh, to continue or F2 to set it up. I just wanna press F1 here to boot up the computer and I'm good to go, okay? So I hope this helps. Leave your comments here, what works for you or what doesn't work for you so other people can also check your comments and get some help, right? So leave your comments, subscribe to this channel, and I see you in the next video.